students are yet again, and for this time, I'll be doing a graduation inspired makeup look. So this one is a really about graduation. This is here in the Philippines during March and April. Those are the two months for graduation here. So I'm creating this look to give you a suggestion or an idea on how you can make your graduation look. Really simple, really smoky and neutral, but you definitely everybody can wear this with any type of dress that you will be wearing on that special day. So I'm really hoping that you will like this look and stay tuned for the tutorial. Have a great day everyone and happy graduation back 2011. Okay ladies, so it's time for me to show you how I created the look. So basically for this look, all you need to have are smoky brown eyeshadows. So if you have a neutral palette, it's going to be a great job. So you just have to stick around with those neutral ones. And it's going to be the basic or the very main eyeshadow colors that we're going to use today. So I'll be showing to you the palette that I use. This one's from Sephora. So in the Philippines, we don't have any Sephora. I just got this from a graduation present from my boyfriend's mother. So thank you so much, Tita. We're going to use this one <laughs> for our eyeshadow today. So there you go. Let me just open this one. So by the way, don't mind the ugly nails because my nails are so puffy and ugly today. But basically, all that I'll be using are this. This one, this, I don't know, sorry, this one, this one, and this one. Only these three colors right there. So those are the colors that I have used for my entire eye. So let's get started. So let's go ahead now. Let me just step closer to you guys. Oh, right. We really have to prime the lids first. So just use any primer. So, on a graduation, you need to like stay fresh all day long. So, we're going to use the first color is this one. It's like a golden, golden color. But if you have a color similar to this one, then that will be better. So get any kind of a brush, so preferably any eyeshadow brush that looks like that. And we're going to use it and pat it all over the lid. We're now moving on to the next one. Using the same brush that we used, we're going to use this color now. This one. This one is more of a like um, brownish and goldish tone. So you have to use that one. Same brush. Then pat it onto the outer crease and go all the way in. That's it. Now this time I'm going to use like a pencil brush, just like this, and we're going to use this brown here, darkest one, okay, and I just want you to pat it 
onto your outer V. Right now your outer V outer V guys. And don't forget to go all the way in itself. You can also use the second brownish, goldish tone that you use a lot of them. There. Now, I'm going to use a blending brush and we're going to use this white one for highlight. And this one will also be used to blend all the harsh colors. I mean harsh edges that we created a while ago. We use that to blend everything together. And use that same white one and put it onto the inner corners just to brighten up the look a little bit more. There, which is equal. Then we're going to use a type of one here. Just use any black eyeliner and then like do this and line the upper left line. And also the lower lash line. And now it's time for us to fill the lashes and put on mascara. Not for your false lashes, as you know, I'm not using any false lashes, so I'm just gonna say with my own, you know, lashes. Cause every graduation, you tend to cry a little bit just for everything that you will be missing. All right, so we're done with the eyes. There, I also curled my lashes using very simple. No eyelash curler and mascara. Now we're done with this. I want you to see it even better. Okay, now let's proceed to the blush. We're going to use the same one here in the Sephora palette and here. This one right here. Oh, so sorry. This one up here. We're going to use that for the blush. And you can also use some highlights. The one in the middle that we have is a highlighter. So just get enough of that. Work on your outer V and you need to see here. And to the bridge of the nose. There you go. Just and peachy colored blush will do. And for the lipstick, I just use my Water Shine Pure. This one is from Mizzoumi. You are 31. I don't know if you can see, but this is the 
the color. All right, that's it for our graduation look. So let me just get a little bit farther so that you can see that's really the look that we have today. Really simple and fun. So that's it for the graduation look. And for all of those graduates, I'm really wishing you good luck in your career. And I hope you will do well entering the real world. So yes, congratulations, that's 2011. Thank you for watching, guys. Bye! Uh, I'm